Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here. We're doing Kata's Almanac deck reviews all week long. Started on Sunday. We're going to go all the way through Saturday because I got six of these. Six decks to look at. I actually did a review for decks one, two, and three already. Did them, I think, a year ago or maybe even two years ago. Um, I ended up getting decks four, five, and six recently. And so I thought, you know what? Instead of just doing four, five, and six later, let's just do all six back to back to back to back to back and do an incredible giveaway at the end of this. So stick around to the end of this video and I'll tell you how to win all six decks in a Gilded Edition. The second transformation deck issued by Kata is also from 1806. Following the remarkable success of the first Almanac deck, this deck was also aimed to have well-known court cards. The interesting main characters and features uh, from this deck are people from classical antiquity, such as Greek and Roman plays, and also the Bible which adds to more historical value and rarity. So here's the back design for deck number two. And as you can see, it's all done in green to match the tuck case. Originally, when these decks were released, they had no back design. So they were blank backed with square corners. And of course, we wouldn't have decks like that today. And so what Azura de Ox and Will Roya have done is they have made a recreation of a back design that would have been typical of cards back then. But I also want to show you the other six colors. So these are the other six colors. So if you were getting get the whole set, decks one through six, it would look like this. But take note that these are not just recolors. It's not like they came up with one pattern and just gave it to you in six different colors. Each one of these backs is an original color and an original pattern. This deck, like all the other Kata's Almanac cards, are transformation decks. Now a transformation deck is where every single picture is a work of art and it's usually one way. The court cards are usually the only ones that have less detail and uh, resemble specific people. The rest of the cards when put together generally follow a theme or follow a story and sometimes if the artist is creative they can work the pips into the background so that they almost disappear and they become part of the deck. Now, the images on the court cards in this deck are from Greek and Roman mythology, characters mostly centered around the Trojan War. And the central figure in this deck is the Queen of Spades. She is the wife of the Trojan military leader, Hector. And another interesting thing to note, especially about the tuck cases on these decks, is if you line them up all side by side, they look like little book spines and they say one, two, three, four, five, six. And so they'll look really cool on your shelf. And all of these decks are printed from the United States Playing Card Company, who of course makes the best decks on the planet. If you head on over to playingcarddecks.com, you will find these uh, at various prices. Uh, they're between $11 and $14 a piece. But they are also in a limited gilded edge. So you can also buy these decks with a gilded, like chromed out, right, foil, bling sides, and those are 40 a piece. Now, like I said earlier, PlayingCardDecks.com allowed me to get a whole set of six. So I have a whole set of six gilded decks, still shrink wrapped, and they even come in a clear lucite case with a magnetic lid. I'm going to give that away this Saturday. <laughs> so this Saturday, I'll have a contest video for all six of those, and I'll give that away as a first prize, and I'll give a second prize away. So all the decks that I've reviewed, all six of these, even though they're open, I will give second place uh, my six decks that I used in my review. So that's two giveaways, right? Two giveaways of the Cottus Almanac decks. Like I said, this Saturday. So you want to come back this Saturday, make sure you've hit like, Make sure you've hit subscribe, make sure you hit follow so that you're alerted when these fantastic giveaways go live. And a big huge thanks to playingcarddecks.com for allowing me to have these decks so that I can do the review for you. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time, bye.